Come on, stop talking to the camera crew. Sorry, I was talking to Brenda. It's always Brenda. Yeah. Uh, good afternoon, Channel Spring Middle School. The announcements for today, Wednesday, September 27, 2017, are the Middle School Drama Club meets tomorrow, Thursday, September 28th, from 3.45 to 4.30 in the pack. Come have fun with this great group. Channel Spring Homecoming Parade tonight at 6.30 p.m. I want to see you there. Spirit dress-up days every day this week. Uh, today is Twin Day. Hi, Twin. We're twins. Woo! Because Green Church, you know. Uh, uh, th tomorrow is Animal Day. So you can be a pig or you can be a monkey, like Jim here. And Friday is Cougar Spirit Day. So okay. you can, well, I don't have a China Spring shirt on, but you should wear a China Spring shirt because China Spring is awesome. Yeah. And Mid School Football plays tomorrow at home against Fairfield. Uh, games begin at 4.30. And now for Caitlin. Hi. This Friday, September 29th, this is China Spring homecoming game against Fairfield. Football tickets are on sale in the office for Friday night's game against Fairfield. They're $4 each or $6 at the gate. You may purchase tickets before school, during lunch, or after school. They stop selling at the end of 7th grade lunch on Friday. Remember, these are student tickets only. Adult tickets can be purchased at the gate the night of the game. Please make sure you have the correct amount. They don't always have enough money to make change. Don't forget to check the lost and found table underneath the library windows for things you might have misplaced. Students who plan to join Leo Club, don't forget to turn in your signed parent permission form to Miss Finley by this Friday, September 29th. You also need to sign up for the Leo Club Remind and Leo Club Google Classroom. Don't forget homecoming spirit dress up days. On Monday, make sure to wear green and bling. Tuesday is crazy hair day. Wednesday is twin day. Thursday is animal day. Rawr. Don't forget about cougar spirit on Fridays. Okay, now we have Miss Deutschman telling us about dress codes. All right, guys, we're doing a lot of good things with dress code, but there are a couple things that we're seeing that we just need some reminders about. The first thing are those off-the-shoulder tops. They're very cute. They're very popular right now. Here's what you have to remember about them. No bare shoulders are allowed. So if you're going to wear one of those tops, you have to have like a two inch wide strap tank top underneath it. Spaghetti straps won't work. Undergarments in that place won't work. It's gotta be the two inch wide strap. Um, another reminder is pants. When you wear pants with slits in them, the slits have to be below fingertip length. If they're not, they can't be worn at school. The last reminder is with short length. Now it's getting a little colder, so this might not come up as much, but remember if we have nice warm days, that your shorts are fingertip length. If you do that, make sure no undergarments are showing. We are good to go. Have a great day. The quote of the day is, you can't change what's going on around you until you start changing what's going on within you. Welcome back to CSESP where we talk about the latest sports updates. Today we're talking about China Spring Middle School football again. So after the China Spring Middle School football teams went to Troy and they defeated them, all three teams, by at least eight points, they are hoping and going to our field this week for homecoming and defeating uh, the Fairfield Eagles the same way they defeated Cameron Yo and the Troy Cho Trojans. Oh, didn't see you there. Hey, it's Olivia, and I'm here to talk to you about the Kindness Video Challenge. As discussed in last week's Kindness Assembly, we are going to be hosting a Kindness Video Challenge. Students submit your school-appropriate kindness videos by uploading them to your Google Drive using your school account and share it with Ms. Finley. Ms. Finley will get the videos to those who need them for the judging the contest. Videos should be one to two minutes long. The winner of the Kindness Video Challenge will have their video featured in the announcements. Get started making other amazing videos and good luck.